Hi, I'm Pam Allen and welcome back to Pam's Picks. This is my spring edition and today we're going to talk to a cobbler about how to prepare your shoes for spring and uh, if you need any advice on how to care for them or any anything that has to do with shoes. We have an expert and he's from France and he's going to tell us a little bit about the designers from France and it's going to be great news for you who love shoes. See you soon. Welcome back to Pam's Picks. Uh, today I'm at La Galoche and this is located in Marpole. And Fred is our cobbler. Hi. And Fred, you have been here for how long now? I just bought the business actually for oh. almost a couple of years in May. Mm -hmm. um, and it's doing very well. I love the marble area. It's, uh, to me, it's better than being on Kingsway. You know, there's lots of green and people are very friendly and I'm getting busier and busier. Oh, excellent. Now your base uh, was France, of course. So you're trying to be more French uh, cobbler? Yes, than I'm trying to mm -hmm. go into a specific niche because mm -hmm. uh, uh, it's what I want to do and I, I feel comfortable doing that. And that way I know the product and, right. and people seem to, to, to appreciate that. And uh, so far, so good. Ah, so what, it, what are the benefits of, of French products versus, say, <laughs> Spanish or well, this Brazilian? I, I have, or I have a, 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 a market here. It looks like, not just, but it looks like lots of Asians buy those shoes and they appreciate when, when, when they come to a, uh, someone who has worked on those shoes a lot mm -hmm. and use the product like, like fam I don't know if I can say the yes, name, of course, Famaco, yeah. mm -hmm. Saphir, all those um, really good French cream and, and shoe care products recommended by Christian Dior and Chanel. Uh -huh. They like they like to come here and 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 talk to me about uh, you know what's best for their their shoes. Ah, okay. So you you definitely have a niche then for for the French products. Now, if you were to suggest. Um, the, the care for each type of the shoes. What would you, so say this is a patent well, leather This is pattern, shoe. yes. yes so so the, for pattern, you, you need a specific uh, pattern cleaner. For new bug, you need a specific uh, cleaner and protector. You, the shoes, you need, you need, well, you can't protect those because if you put something on, on the pattern, it's going to mess them up, but you can mm -hmm. clean them. Mm -hmm. but, but, but shoes that are like very delicate, like suede and, and, ah. and, and new bug and specific light color, you can't just wear them of course. in Vancouver, it, no. just like that, because you're going to end up with stains, you know, mm -hmm. unless you, you spray them a lot with protector, but even black suede is okay. Mm -hmm. Dark brown is okay. It's, mm -hmm. not, it's, it's the color and the type of leather. Okay, so suede is is definitely not <laughs> not a spring <laughs> spring shoe, right? Mm, not, not so much. Yes, <laughs> well, to so wear at the office or for you know, but not to outside. go to a, yeah. Right. Okay. So it is spring now. So let's uh, give us some hints on what we should do besides spraying our shoes. So how to prepare your spring shoes in Vancouver with the rain? Um, it's a it's a it's it's a matter of. Uh, what you are wearing. So le on this specific shoe, you can't, you can't use any spray that will mm -hmm. protect and prevent. It's, it's up to you and, 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 and having some tips from me mm -hmm. to, to know where to wear the shoes and on what occasion and what to do with the shoes. You, you can't like uh, wear, you know, shoes with a high heel like, like those guys, you know, mm -hmm. and walk on pavement for two kilometers after a party because right. that's going to ruin the, the tips. Those right. are not meant for that. Pattern shoes, you can't, you can't protect them. Fabric you can, you can mm -hmm. use a spray, mm -hmm. to a water repellent spray, you see, mm -hmm. that's for fabric, new bug, mm -hmm. um, suede and smooth leather. So you, you spray and mm -hmm. the water won't soak in and leave stains. Okay. But you won't keep your, f your feet, feet dry. dry. People okay. get confused with protector that, that, that are waterproofing for, mm -hmm. for keeping your feet dry. It doesn't do that. Ah. That you have to invest into shoes that are waterproofed. Oh, or okay. you can get any pair of shoes and put some wax, like yeah. um, candle oh. wax. No, that's, that's not attractive. <laughs> then okay. you keep your feet dry. <laughs> so the, my one bugbear is when I purchase a, a pair of shoes, they have those plastic, you know, when you're talking about the, uh, the, the, uh, the, heel the high tips. heels. Yes. So, my suggestion to anyone it be would be to bring it into you to put in a proper 
proper heal. When you say proper, there's, 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 uh, the first reason why people come to me with brand new shoes is because it doesn't matter the cost of the shoe, they put plastic heels. Mm -hmm. And so it's slippery and noisy. Right. And so right. we, have, we, we use rubber, mm -hmm. durable as well. But one, when I say durable, again, it's not to walk on pavement for one kilometer. Of course not. Those shoes are not meant for that. But then once I put the heel tips, for $12. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's comfortable <laughs> and, and, and you get some good grip. Ah, perfect. Well, if you have any questions, uh, Fred is the one that you need to come and talk to regarding any type of shoe or boot. Yes. So the cobbler in Marpole and it is La Goloche. And Very good. the uh, address? Uh, the address is 1035 West 67 Avenue. Okay. Right uh, west from the Starbucks. Okay. The Starbuck and is. right off of Oak Street. So thank you, Fred. No, thank you for okay. uh, interviewing this me. This has been a pleasure. Thank you. Yes, yeah. thank you. Pat. And that's it for today. Uh, spring keeps coming on and we're still in the rain. So stay tuned. Mm -hmm.